politics of the movie were always in the geography and the aesthetics of the film. We wanted to make a movie that could just be about a, a mother who's trying to figure out how to grieve imperfectly. And the sort of larger politics of what is at stake and what is the cause that this character is now in this swirling inferno of bullshit. Hey mom. All of that stuff and all of that idea of this community that's under this sort of gigantic, nameless erection of like, <laughs> you know, stone and, and metal felt like that's like, that's really what the movie is about. So much of Albany is the Empire State Plaza, which is just like this upward thrust of these buildings that are huge and like we're shooting anamorphic. So like actually being able to do this kind of swoop down and also like the whole opening sequence, this almost train POV that then just kind of takes off, showcases the city and it feels momentous and gives you that like adrenaline that I think you need. Ironically, I always wanted to do like a female thriller about the opiate epidemic. We were making the movie at a very reasonable price point, Miles had a resume as a director that was impressive and exciting to the financier. Miles had met Hillary before and like I had met her agent. Olivia Cook was already attached to it. Um, and then we just had to cast the rest of the roles. 